and welcome back to Let's Play Star Wars The Phantom Menace. Here we are on Coruscant, playing as Captain Panaka, who is actually a most annoying character to play. But, whatever. This way, your highness. And oh, surprise! You must find a way to escape this platform. <laughs> Craptastic. Aim at it, you bitch! <laughs> Alright. Not too bad a start, I guess. The laser blast just grazed my shoulder. That's probably one of the most annoying things. There she is! Get her! I've got her! That, however, is not fun at all. We must find a way to escape this platform. Hurry! Shush. Ah, get out of my way. Yeah, what a great start to this level. Welcome to Coruscant. Would you like to go to the tourist center? Yes, please. Oh, very good, sir. Please keep your arms and legs in the transport at all times. This is... yeah. As I was saying, this is a most annoying level. Because Captain Panaka is so weak. And pretty much without lightsabers. This game really sucks. Do you think it is safe to proceed? And of course Queen Amidala is a wounded bitch. And such forth. Welcome to Coruscant. How may I be of service? Call the guards, we're being attacked. I'm sorry, sir, but I am simply an information resource droid. I can't help you. Then can you tell us how to reach the Senate? There are taxi landings through the blue door. And I believe that the city tour stops at the Senate Chamber. Where do we take the tour? Go through the black door. The tour is located on the opposite side of this level. Thank you. Alright, let's go take a tour of Coruscant then. And yeah, I think I'll save that health for when I really need it. Which will be soon. Welcome to Coruscant City Tours. Does the tour stop at the Senate Chambers? Yes, sir. The City Tour stops at the Jedi Temple, the Senate Chamber, Monument Plaza, Kalakur Heights, and many other incredible sites. How much are tickets? Tickets for the City Tour are 100 Republic credits each. I was forced to leave my homeworld in great haste, and I did not bring any Republic credits with me. I'm sorry, sir, but we only deal in Republic credits here on Coruscant. When does the next tour leave? The next city tour air transport departs in ten minutes. I'll return with some Republic credits. Very well, sir. I await your return. Yes, most annoying. <laughs> because punching and kicking is a great help in the Star Wars universe. Now, it's one of those floaty things. Where is he? I will survive. Hello, friend. Uh, can I help you? I'm trying to sell these electro binoculars. Well, they appear to be in good order. They aren't stolen, are they? No, I am the legal owner of these electro binoculars, I assure you. Well, in that case, I'm willing to offer 100 Republic credits for the pair. Does that sound reasonable? Yes, thank you. I hope you enjoy these. Even though we need 200 Republic credits. But look, another way around it. Greetings, citizen. 
I am in a bit of a dilemma. I was wondering if perhaps you could help me. Yes, how can we help? I have purchased two tickets for the city tour, but I have important business on Alderaan and must leave at once. I was hoping that I could sell them to you. How much are you asking? How about 50 Republic credits each? That's half what I paid for them. Yes, that sounds like a good plan. Enjoy the tour! It does sound like a good plan, and it's a very convenient plot convention. But, frankly, if it was me, I'd be a bit creeped out. We have to get out of if here! If Captain Panaka was talking to me, he's like, Rawr! And so forth. <laughs> Slash, I don't know what I'm talking about. Another way to the Senate chamber. Oh, crap, fuck. Are you serious? Okay, fuck that. Queen is in the way. And I just killed her. Stupid bitch. I'm not hurt. I'm badly bruised. The laser blast just I don't know if I can shoulder. survive another attack. For fuck's sake. Stupid woman. Welcome back, sir. Enjoy the tour. And look, another inconvenient occurrence. I'm not jumping down there. And this is the most annoying uh, bit of. Well, it is a highly annoying section to do if you don't know what you're doing. More hover cannons will be coming. But, made more annoying by the fact that Queen Amidala is spouting off, like, two lines of dialogue every 20 seconds or so. We must hurry. Yes, I, uh, I realize we must hurry, Miss Amidala, but frankly, you need to shut the fuck up so I can do my job. Thank you, and have a pleasant day. We have to get out of here. I know! Are you fucking retarded? Yes. Uh no, that's not the one I want to press. We'll be coming back soon. And now I'm stuck. You'll never get out of here alive. And look, how fun. Queen Aridala gets kidnapped. Yet it appears that she follows them willingly. And that's just ridiculous. But since that's the case, I'm going to go and get that health because I need it. Oh yes, and they also blow up the lift, which is rather annoying. But at least I am grateful for the fact that I no longer have to worry about escorting Queen Amidala. At least not for now. Makes my job just a little bit easier. Considering that Captain Panaka really is quite useless. Interesting slash irrelevant fact for you. Um, there are cheats in this game that allow you to use Um, well, to swap out the characters on the different levels, so I could play this as either Qui Gon or Obi Wan and have a an interesting time of it. But instead, I'm doing it legit. So, um, but yeah, because there's no water in this level, Captain Panaka has like no swim animation. Well, yeah, there's no swim animation, and consequently, um, if you do use him on other levels where there is water, he just kind of like, his uh, weird dress thing sort of expands and allows him to float, which is quite hilarious, if you're easily amused of course. 